Welcome back. Tonight we're kicking off our week long series on recovery from addictions. Andy Randall takes us to new beginnings now in Hutchinson. Craig, we start by looking at an organization preparing people in recovery for life after treatment. Hutchinson is making waves in the recovery community. This is a 30 year old community development organization. New Beginnings offers a different life to people getting sober. We started building affordable housing uh, so that we could help offset homelessness. And at that point, we started working, realizing that so much of what we were working with uh, had to do with addiction. President and CEO Shara Gonzalez helped bring in the transitional jobs program. Working with uh, people to get them ready for uh, permanent employment. William Baggett is the kitchen manager. We got everything else prepared. A program graduate with over two years sobriety. I was at one time that broken person that didn't think that I would ever be able to do anything with my life again. And through the TJP program, they showed me that I was capable. This is his safe place. I didn't have to worry about coming to work and worrying about seeing somebody else that was using because that doesn't happen. You know, we're all in a sobriety program together. And that right there is worth its weight in gold to somebody that's trying to fight for a better life. TJP is a six month program with the goal of finding permanent employment. Like Aaron Whittington, who's in charge of security. Um, to see if any of the, the screens or anything have been busted out, if the, the windows might be open, or if anything's broken. A big part of his job is de-escalation. <laughs> Only contacting police as a last resort. So we're trying to change the image on what people think of when they think of security. Keeping the focus on recovery and building a better life. Now, I'm not gonna say that it's easy, because it's not, and there's days that are truly tough. But the days that are truly tough, it doesn't matter what direction I turn, I always have somebody there for me. A new beginning and life William can now smile about. <laughs> <laughs> so New Beginnings has a 70% success rate of people moving into permanent employment. 42% of its employees are program graduates. Now the program is just in Hutchison right now, but they're working on a model where this program can move to any community. Here for you, I'm Eddie Randall, KSN News 3.